everyone welcome back to pure lottie so today's video is what i have been purchasing lately so if you want to see what i have in today's video then make sure you keep watching and if you like today's video don't forget to hit the thumbs up down below because it really helps me out and if you're new don't forget to join my family hit that subscribe button and change that notification bell to all so you don't miss any of my future videos all right let's jump in So the first package is from Slick Hair and this is what I use to get rid of all my flyaways. So I've gone through one full bottle of this and I reckon I'm halfway through this one. So I jumped online and brought some more. I picked up a trio pack. So let me show you. So I picked up the Triple Slick Hair Bundle. It was about 72 Australian dollars and it came with three of the hair gels. Um, the packaging has now changed. It is in this circular bottle now compared to the square one. Um, and it's a beautiful, nice, like matte pink. Um, let me just see what the... Okay, the brush is still the same. It's just the actual container that is different. Um, it feels a lot nicer. This one is like just a tube and it's got a sticker around it, whereas this is actually all printed onto the bottle. So yeah, I picked up the triple pack and in the triple pack, it also came with a three piece silk scrunchies and it is all pink. So it's a hot pink, a baby pink and a white scrunchie in there. So very happy with that. I absolutely love this product. So I know I'll be going through these quickly. That's why I did pick up the triple bundle versus just one. So the next package I got is from Nakia Joy Cosmetics. Um, so I swear by her velvet finishing powder. So I am almost out of my second container of it. Probably less than half I've got left in here so I picked up a new one so then I don't run out so I also really love her lashes so I did pick up some more lashes um I do have a five pack from her already it's the petite set here and I absolutely love them I've used them to death and I definitely need to uh bin these ones now because yeah I've worn them so many times and they are falling apart now but i picked up this time the natural set so it looks like this and it has a five lashes in it and i also picked up an individual one and this is uh zara and it's a nice big full glam lash so i'm going to use this for my more out there looks and then this is for more of my like everyday looks or if i'm just like going somewhere then i can put these ones on so the next order that i have done is with glam raider and it comes in this cute iridescent box which i think is pretty cool um everything is bubble wrapped now, my mother-in-law and I actually uh, did an order together. So I picked up some replacement P. Louise eye bases because I'm almost out. So this is my Ride or Die eye primer. Um, so I picked up Rumor 01 and Rumor 0. Unfortunately, they didn't have 0 0.5 in stock. Um, but it doesn't look like too much of a color difference for the one. Um, and I like using 0 when I'm doing like really bright, vibrant colors because that makes it stand out a lot more. So I picked up those two. And my mother-in-law picked up Rumor 2 and Rumor 3. So a bit darker. She has um, a much darker skin tone to me. Um, so yeah, we've got here 0, 1, 2 and 3. So we're only missing 0 0.5. And then she also picked up a... Wet and Wild Liquid Cut Suit Metallic Liquid Eyeshadow in Shells and Whistles. And it looks like this. But we haven't opened this yet. She's um, left it with me so that I could show you guys. And it has got like a massive air bubble or something. Or it's dried up in there. 
So I'll be interested for her to open it and see if it is all dry or not. Um, I will update you guys in maybe my vlog or something when I give it to her. And the last thing for this order, I picked up this Split Cake UV Neons Retro Liner. So it is the water activated cake liner um, and it is like a big rainbow version of that. I haven't tried a water activated liner before. Um, so I wanted to pick this up so I could give it a shot, but it has multiple colors in there. So I'm excited to try this out. Um, so the next package that I've got, I picked up whilst I was with James Beauty Space uh, the other day when we went shopping together. And we went to the MAC store um, and the MAC Prep and Prime Fix It Spray is my ride or die setting spray. So I went to get some more replacements. Um, so I'm almost out. I can't even tell you how many bottles I've gone through of this. There is like barely anything left in there. Um, so I picked up another two bottles. I just got the standard one, um, just the standard clear one. I'm, I do like the, uh, shimmery ones, but not for like an everyday makeup. I can always add shimmer if I want extra shimmer. Um, so yeah, I picked up two of those and I also picked up a smaller version of it as well. Um, just for when I'm traveling, then I don't have to take the big chunky ones with me. Um, because I can't find my other little one. I used to just have one and I would tip a little bit in there as I would run out. Um, so yeah, I picked up another small one. And then whilst we were there, I also was mentioning to James that I want to try the strobe cream. Um, and it's an old school like YouTube favorite. And the lady heard me and she gave me a small sample. Well, actually, it's quite a bit of a sample. So she gave me the pink one. Um, so it is a complete full like tub here. So I can definitely give this a shot and see if I like it enough to purchase it then. So then we also went to a price line and I picked up on James's recommendation um, from Makeup Revolution. It is their Shimmer Bombs. So it's a lip gloss with vitamin E and um, he uses them as like a lip topper or just a straight up lip gloss and they are absolutely stunning. So yeah, I wanted to pick them up. So I got the colors Sparkle, which is like a pinky shimmery color. It's a very light pink um, and it has like, you know, green, blue, purpley reflex in there as well. And then I also picked up the color Light Beam and this is just a like a white cleary color with like silver shimmer through it. So I'm excited to give those a shot. I always love a lip gloss and I always love a sparkle. So I know I'm going to love them. So the next thing that I brought, I got from James Beauty Space. Um, and that is because we placed an order together um, to save on shipping because shipping to Australia is so costly when it's from like an American company. So we both picked up the Michaela Cross Glam Light Palette. Now we have been waiting over two months for this um, palette. So I did have him open it to make sure it was all good. Um, oh my goodness, this is my first time actually seeing it in person. Um, wow, this is cool. It has like glitter in the front and I suppose I should put it that way. And it just, oh my goodness, how cool is that? And it's got her name, Michaela, and Glam Light on the front. And then opening it up. Oops. Got the clear plastic in here. There is a really nice size mirror. And then we have all the colors. So I'm super, super excited about playing with this palette. So I'm actually going to be doing an Instagram live with James. Um, we were meant to do it yesterday, um, the 19th of August. I'm filming this on the 20th. Um, but unfortunately, I had some change of plans with 
uh, things and I just wasn't able to fit it in anymore. So uh, we've rescheduled to next week. It will probably be on Wednesday um, afternoon. And we're going to both try the palette for the first time and create a look with it. So if you want to see what our thoughts are and what we create with it, then make sure you head over to our Instagram. Um, I will add my Instagram on the screen for you. And yeah, join us in our live. So whilst we were shopping as well, I also picked up a bunch of um, brushes. So I picked up from Kmart this OXX Artist Toolkit and it basically has like disposable things in it. So I picked this up. It was only I think about 10 bucks. Um, but yeah, I picked this up because sometimes... Um, like when I use gloss and stuff, I just use my finger at the moment so that I don't stain like the doe foot applicator. Um, so yeah, I thought that would be good. And anything that I don't want like staining my actual brushes, I can use this and then dispose of. Or if I have somebody come over and they want to use something, then they can use this. So it's um, all hygienic. And then I also picked up four e.l.f. brushes. And I picked up... The eyeliner brush, the eyeshadow brush, the eye crease, and the blending eye brush. So these were all like $3 each from Kmart. Um, they're just all little eyeshadow brushes. Um, I A lot of mine have been breaking lately, so I have needed some more brushes. So yeah, I thought I would pr pick up some of the e.l.f. ones. Then I also dashed across to Chemist Warehouse before I came home and I picked up this Flower Beauty Eyeshadow Jewel Ended Brush. So it's an eyeshadow um, shading brush and a blending brush. So it is a double ended one that has a brush there and a brush there. So I'm going to give that a shot. It was the only Flower Beauty brush they had. Um, I did want to get some more, um, but unfortunately they didn't have any others there. And I also picked up this Glam Pro by Manicare and it's a professional series essential eye brush. So it's got a tapered blending brush, an all over shader brush, a precision shader brush and a pencil brush. <laughs> Get that out. So it is a four set of brushes. So this was on sale. I think I picked it up for like 20 bucks. So, um... Yeah, I thought, why not, seeing as I couldn't get any of the Flower Beauty ones. So I'll give those ones a shot and see how they go. So the last package that I have purchased, um, this was actually a bit of an influenced decision to buy this. Um, I have been looking for some silk, uh, mulberry silk pillowcases to help with my hair. Um, and obviously, you know anti-aging benefits and stuff sleeping on a mulberry silk pillowcase uh, but they have been costing a fortune so um every time an influencer posts about their uh silk pillowcases i always have a look to see if any are on sale so this one was from shan exo i think that's what her youtube is um she's over in new zealand so i knew that it would be one that i could get because if they ship to new zealand they tend to ship to australia as well so i can't even remember the company that we went through but uh she had a discount code and they were also having a sale so we decided to um pick up I picked up two and then my mother-in-law also picked up two so we got it shipped together but I wanted to mention the packaging first because um I wasn't expecting it to look like this it is like glad wrapped almost because it I think it's because it has been security checked but this is like destroyed this is like basically all uh, sticky tape, I guess. Okay, so now that I've opened that, I can actually see they've definitely been inside the packaging. So I don't think the package was like this when it actually left the warehouse. Um, I think it's from them having to open it and do a security check. But the contents inside look really nice. So they are from Lily Silk. So it's Better Silk, Better Life. And the packaging is actually kind of cute. It is this um, white, like matte sort of finish. It has these flowers on it. And it's like a mustardy sort of yellowy color. It looks a bit more green on 
camera, but it's actually more of a yellow color. Okay, so I picked up two sets. Um, one set is navy blue and one set is black. My mother-in-law picked up a set of the black ones as well. So let me pop hers to the side and I will show you what the navy and the black look like. So we paid $42 and I think 17 cents per um, pillowcase. So this is how they come packaged inside. So it has a bit of tissue paper. It has a really nice like gold labels all over it. And then the pillowcase is folded up in here. So this is the navy blue. And let's have a look at it. It feels really, really nice and soft. So this is what it looks like. So just a standard like pillowcase. So it has a little booklet here, um, which was in the bottom. And it has got in here that Lily Silk is a luxury silk brand founded in 2011. It is committed to redefining the silk industry. The Mulberry Silk is the finest grade, so 6A at an honest price. It is certified by Swiss authority of Okio... Oiko Tech Standard, sorry. <laughs> um, a motley team of top designers with shared passion for silk and in the pursuit of affordable luxury lifestyle. So it does have a 45 day money back guarantee um, and you can also get them, them monogrammed, custom monogrammed. I didn't bother. Um, and then on the back, it's got some of their other products. So it's got a whole pile of like silk clothing that they do. On this side, it has a bedding set that they do. So yeah, I'm interested to try these out. Um, if you want to hear more info about them, keep an eye on my speed reviews because I will definitely pop them in there once we start using them. And just for comparison, this is the black color. So a really nice black. Um, and I just chose standard darker colors because we do have animals and the navy blue and the black will go with our current doona covers that we have. So yeah, I'm excited to give these a shot um, and I will definitely keep you guys updated in my speed reviews on this. So that is everything that I have picked up recently. I hope you enjoyed today's video. If there's anything you want me to try on camera, let me know down in the comments so I can make sure to feature it in a future video. And if you do like today's video, don't forget to hit the thumbs up down below because it really helps me out. And if you're new, don't forget to join my family, hit that subscribe button and change that notification bell to all so you don't miss any of my future videos. And as always, thanks for watching guys. Bye!